It's one of the strangest endings that you will see in the NBA. The New Orleans Pelicans get the victory over the Nets. Brooklyn had this game. Uh, they were up big towards the end, an 8 nothing run for New Orleans to get in front and some strange occurrences, including a turnover. Karis LeVert on the receiving end of a D'Angelo Russell pass that didn't make it to him. And then a technical foul called against Ed Davis during the timeout after a Drew Holiday bucket with the Nets down by two. And uh, this is going to be a bitter pill to swallow for Kenny Atkinson and company. Given the way that the Nets had played throughout the entirety of this ball game, did all the right things, putting themselves in position. And this was a New Orleans team that came in best offense in the league. 3-0 on the season, and you got some of the, the top-tier players like an Anthony Davis who you keep at bay and you do all the right things at both ends of the court. Um, Kenny Atkinson, I'm not sure what he tells his guys in the locker room because they came into the season talking about execution down the stretch, not having any more moral victories, and they proved it. And so now it's about circling yourselves back up, grabbing that energy yep. again. You're going to play the defending champs on Sunday, but picking apart the things that you did so excellently, the ball movement the efficiency on offense because of their shot selection and because of the way they were finding their teammates and of course defending the way in which they did the connectivity that we saw um, a, a lot of great things to take out of this game but it is going to be very tough considering the way in which they gave it away themselves young players d'angelo russell and karis lavert it's not an excuse it's just a reality and mistakes happen this was a major mistake when New Orleans at that point didn't appear to be in fouling position. The Nets were basically trying to run out the clock and couldn't do it. Well, and that's where it goes back to just understanding time and score. And, and to your point, the Nets bring the ball up the court, expecting to get a foul. And he did an excellent job of playing keep away, using all sides of the floor. And, and it will be something for D'Angelo Russell to go back and take a look at because these are the things of paying yep. attention to detail. And, and paying attention to detail, the little things, will win and lose you ball games. And not it's not always so explicit and so obvious as this one, but, but it is a, a point of emphasis in how they're able to limit their turnovers throughout the course of the season, throughout the course of games, and, and there is nothing more clear than this one and how it can often be your own miscues uh, that, that'll lead you down the path of finding yourself in, in this position. The Nets fall here in New Orleans, a crushing loss at the hands of the Pelicans.